Hello guys, welcome back. In the previous video, we explained what is listed traffic manager profile and in what kind of scenario you would use listed traffic manager profile. Now, in this video, I'm going to demonstrate you how to create or config a nested traffic manager profile. Now, I've already created one traffic manager profile. This is just a typical traffic manager profile. From this configuration, you can see that um, it has been configured to use the performance-based routing method. And it also has three endpoints. Each endpoint is an app service in the corresponding Azure region. So the first one is in East Asia, the second one is in West US, and the last one is in Australia East. I've also created um, three Azure virtual machines to simulate the clients from each of the region. So the first one is Australia East, second one is East Asia, and then the last one is West US. Now we know that uh, the Azure Traffic Manager is a DNS-based load balancer. So I also developed this uh, very simple test uh, script. So in this script, it will try to resolve the traffic manager's FQDN and return the C name. Uh, it will try to do that for 100 times. And at the end of the script, it will tell us you know, how many times it's been uh, redirected to each of the endpoints. So now if I run this test script, on um, all those three clients, it will tell us um, how many times being resolved to each of the endpoints. So okay, so as you can see here, the from the Australia East clients, all of the DNS uh, query were resolved to the Australia East endpoint, right? And and the same for the East Asia clients. All the queries were resolved to the East Asia endpoint. And as well as for the West US clients, 100% queries were resolved to the West US endpoint. Now, what if we want to add the fourth endpoint, which is the Australia Southeast uh, endpoint? Um, and we also want to use different uh, traffic routing method for the Australia endpoints, Australia East and Australia Southeast endpoints. So what we need to do, we will need to create another um, traffic manager profile and put that um, traffic manager profile underneath the current traffic manager profile. So first of all, we will need to re remove the current Australia East endpoint because this one will be one of the endpoints of the new uh, traffic manager profile. Now, after we deleted this uh, endpoint from the current traffic manager profile, we will need to create a new traffic manager profile. This traffic manager profile is going to be our um, child profile. So, for example, we give name child profile, and the routing method we want it to be different from the uh, parent traffic manager profile. And we choose weighted um, routing method for this one, and we choose a resource group for it. So we create this traffic manager profile, and then we will add the two Australia endpoints underneath this child traffic manager profile. It should be created, and just give it a bit of time to refresh the page. So here we go, we have the new child profile created. So now let's go underneath this child profile. Now we've already configured the routing method to wait it so we will leave it as it is and then we go underneath the endpoints to add these two Australia uh, app service as the new profiles endpoints so this child profile is nothing different from a, a typical traffic manager profile so here we're going to add those two Australia so the type we will choose Azure endpoint and we'll give it a name Australia East first and then the target resource type we choose app service because that's the endpoints uh, being configured so we will choose the Australia East 01 and then give it weights so let's say this one we want 
uh, sorry, let's say this one, we want 80%. And OK, so we add the other one, Australia Southeast. Add your endpoint again and name Australia Southeast and then tag the resource type app service and we will choose the Australia Southeast 01 and now we will give it uh, weight 20. So which means 20% of the traffic from all of the Australia based clients will be redirected to this endpoint. Okay, so as soon as we added those two endpoints to this child profile, what we could do next one is we can then add this child profile as a listed profile to the previous uh, traffic manager profile. So from here we can see we have the other two endpoints and now we can add another endpoints here. So this, this time we will not choose Azure endpoint, we will choose listed endpoint. So with this one we'll give it a name Australia. And the target resource, we will choose a traffic manager profile. As you can see here, we can only choose the child profile because that's the only other traffic manager profile I have right now. So here you will need to uh, assign a location to this endpoint because this because uh, our uh, parent traffic manager profile is configured to performance-based. So location, we go with Australia. Australia, uh, let's choose Australia East as the location for this endpoint. And uh, here is one parameter we might want to configure, which is the minimum child endpoints. That means that um, for this nested endpoint, uh, if there are multiple endpoints underneath that um, nested endpoint. So this configuration tells the parent traffic manager profile that how many uh, child endpoints need to be you know, health to declare the uh, child endpoint as uh, health. So um, uh, if we choose one, it means that um, as long as we have one child endpoint um, health, we would decline the um, nested profile as a health profile. So, okay, let's just create this um, endpoint and give it a bit of time. And here we go. So, this endpoint uh, has already been created and um, put it under the parent um, traffic manager profile. Now, at this point of time, if we go back to our um, Clients or our hash or virtual machines. Let's run the test um, script again, so that we will tell us um, which endpoints the uh, the clients would be redirected to. So okay, so the all these three clients finished the um, test script running. So from the Astrana East um, client, we can see that um, it has been redirected to the Astrana East for 76 times and been redirected to Astrana Southeast for 24 times. So that's not too bad because we configured 20 to 80. So that's not too bad. So now let's have a look at the East Asia and West US now. So this apparently this does not have any impact on the East Asia clients at all and should be the same case for West US. So all the traffic or all, all the DNS query from the West US client were a redirect to the West US endpoint. So that's pretty good. So that's the basically that's the configuration of the listed traffic manager profile. We mentioned that there is a configuration for the nested profile, which is the minimum child endpoints. So in some cases, we want to make sure all of the child endpoints are health, you know, just to claim the uh, listed traffic manager profile as a health profile. So in this case, we could change this minimum child endpoints to whatever you want. Let's say we want it to be, you know, two. In that case, if we save that, and now if we go to the child profile, and if we disable one of the endpoints, so for example, if we disable the Australia East endpoint, 
then because now we don't have two health um, child endpoints in this nested traffic manager profile. Uh, in this case, the parent traffic manager profile would not declare the child profile as a health uh, profile. As we can see from here, the Australia uh, child profile or the child endpoint has been marked as unhealth. So at this point in time, no client's traffic would be redirected to this Australia nested traffic profile. Okay, let's just go to the clients to verify this. So for example, if we run that again on those three clients, we should be able to see that um, all of the um, DNS queries from the clients should be redirected to the other two endpoints. So, okay, so as you can see here, that um, all the DNS queries from the Australia East clients were redirected to this to East Asia endpoint. That's because we disabled one of the um, endpoints inside the child profile, and that made the child profile uh, on hills from the parent traffic manager profile's point of view. So the traffic from the Australia East clients then would be redirected to the closest uh, region, which is East Asia. Now for the other um, for the other two clients in the other two regions, the um, DNS query has uh, has not been impacted. Traffic from the East Asia clients still being redirected to the East Asia endpoints and the traffic from the West US clients are still redirected to the West US endpoints. So that concludes the demonstration of the listed traffic manager profile. Again, if you guys have anything interested or any new features or anything you want to know, please just leave your comments or your feedback. I will try my best to create a demo for you. Thank you for watching.